Welcome to A to Z Redemption's podcast titled Word or World View. There is only a one letter difference between the words word and world, but they are realms apart. Like the two trees in the Garden of Eden, we have only one choice. It's either having a word view or a world view. There is no middle ground for any of us. Remember, even the tiniest bit of yeast leavens the entire loaf. As believers in Jesus Christ, Yeshua, who is the word that became flesh, so too the word must become flesh, alive, active, and sharper than a double-edged sword in us. Therefore, let us take the word view position and become rooted and grounded in the word without apology in a world view culture. In other words, if the perspective view or position is not established in the word of God, it's not for me no matter how attractive, appealing, or popular it may appear. There are many seemingly right-sounding worldviews today that are not word-based. I'm sure many readily come to mind. Just like the tree of the knowledge of good and evil were appealing to the eye, appealing to the flesh, and ignited the pride of life, so too are today's worldviews that are not rooted in the word of God. Beloved of Adonai, the time to have one and only one identity is now. Either we identify with the word or the world. Either we have the mind of Christ or the mind of the world. Either we live, move, and have our being in the word or the world that is in every arena, political, financial, moral, cultural, racial, national, liberal, conservative, in every sphere of life. Again, there is no middle ground. Remember, we are born again into the kingdom of heaven, not the world. Our citizenship is in heaven, not this world that we are momentarily passing through. As such, we are invited to put on the mind of Christ, to think like the king of our kingdom. Remember, the word, it is no longer I who lives, but Christ who lives in me. Thank you for listening.